Hi, I'm Colin. And I'm Emily. And this is Balboa's first newscast of the year. So what's going on in October? On Wednesday the 3rd, we'll have Picture Day retakes. And be prepared on the 19th, because that's the last day of the first quarter. Did I mention how well our band did at our annual back-to-school night? Also, our ASV was a huge help and made sure everyone had a great time. Now over to Don, who will be interviewing Mr. Roth. Hello, my name is Don Renier, and today I'll be interviewing Mr. Roth, the 7th grade science teacher. Thanks so for having me, Don. Thanks for being here. So, Mr. Roth, what classes and clubs are you doing this year? Good question. I am teaching science and for 7th graders again. I'm also teaching my last class is environmental horticulture, which is for 7th and 8th graders. And my first period class is an 8th grade math intervention class. So in environmental horticulture, what have you done so far? So far, the class has gotten, in, gotten into groups called crews, and we've been outside and they, they've uh, started to prepare their area in order to grow their new, new crops for fall. Okay, and what about your 7th grade science class? Has it done any labs so far or anything? No labs yet, because right now we start the year off, we do our uh, project alert, curriculum, which is a health curriculum for drugs and alcohol prevention. And we're almost done with that, and then we'll start some labs. Thank you for your time. This has been a great interview. Thank you, Don. Bye, everybody. Welcome back. Fall break starts on the 20th and ends on the 29th. Now, Brandon will be interviewing our new teacher to the school, Mrs. Bento. Hello, my name is Brent Meixner, and I'm interviewing Mrs. Bento, our new language arts and history teacher. So, how are we liking Balboa so far? Balboa has been a really great experience so far. I've learned a lot about the students. They've been really helpful to me. I've learned a lot about the teachers and staff. They've helped out a lot. And coming from a different school, it's nice to see so many welcoming, open people. So um, what are you doing in your, fit in your classes right now? Right now in language arts, we are finishing up a book by Jack London called Call of the Wild. It's been a good read so far and we're getting ready to move on to a new genre of reading. In history we've studied explorers and colonies and we're working on our tests very soon. So what's your favorite genre? My favorite book genre is mystery and suspense. Anytime I can read a book about that I'm excited and interested. Where did you grow up? I grew up in Ventura. Oh, nice. I went to Will Rogers Elementary School, I went to Cabrillo Middle School and Ventura High School. All right, if you could travel anywhere in the world, where would you go? That's an interesting question. My son actually asked me that this weekend. I have decided I would go to Fiji because I love to lay in the sun, I love to be on the beach, and I love to spend the time in sparkling blue waters. All right, well, thank you so much, Mrs. Bento. Thank you so much for having me. Now on to our student of the month interview. I'm Kaylin, this is Memo, student of the month. What are your favorite hobbies? Uh, playing sports like soccer and football. What superpower would you have and why? Uh, it would be teleportation because I'll be able to go anywhere in the world. What's your favorite class subject? Uh, it would be science. What's your favorite color? It would be blue. What's your favorite TV show? Uh, Wild and Out. What's your favorite food? Uh, pizza. What would you like to have as a future job? Um, I would become a doctor. What's your favorite animal? Um, it would be a dog. How many pets do you have? I have one. Who is your favorite teacher? Uh, Miss Kennedy. Thank you for coming. Thank you for watching this month's video newscast.